Tanya and Ken are actually developers. They really worked with our team to harness the power of actually predictive suggestions in G mode, uh, in G board in the context of Morse code. I'm really excited that G board with Morse code is available in beta later today. You know, it's great to reinvent products with AI. G board is actually a great example of it. Every single day, we offer users and users choose over 8 billion auto corrections each and every day. Another example of a, one of our core products, which we are redesigning with AI, is Gmail. We just had a new, fresher look for Gmail, a recent redesign. Hope you're all enjoying using it. We are bringing another feature to Gmail. We call it Smart Compose. So as the name suggests, we use machine learning to start suggesting phrases for you as you type. All you need to do is to hit tab and keep auto-completing. In this case, it understands the subject is Taco Tuesday. It suggests chips, salsa, guacamole. It, it takes care of mundane things like addresses so that you don't need to worry about it. You can actually focus on what you want to type. I've been loving using it. I've been sending a lot more emails to the company, not sure what the company thinks of it. <laughs> but it's been great. We are rolling out Smart Compose to all our users this month and hope you enjoy using it as well. Another product which we built from the ground up using AI is Google Photos. Works amazingly well and at scale. You know, if you click on one of these photos, what we call the photo viewer experience, where you're looking at one photo at a time, so that you understand the scale, every single day there are over 5 billion photos viewed by our users each and every day. So we want to use AI to help in those moments. So we are bringing a new feature called Suggested Actions, essentially suggesting smart actions right in context for you to act on. Say, for example, you went to a wedding and you're looking through those pictures. We understand your friend Lisa is in the picture, and we offer to share the three photos with Lisa, and with one click, those photos can be sent to her. So the anxiety where everyone is trying to get the picture on their phone, I think we can make that better. Say, for example, if the photo in the same wedding, if the photos are underexposed, our AI systems offer a suggestion to fix the brightness right there, one tap, and we, we can fix the brightness for you. Or if you took a picture of a document which you want to save for later, we can recognize, convert the document to PDF, and make it... <laughs> make it much easier for you to use later. You know, we want to make all these simple cases delightful. By the way, AI can also deliver unexpected moments. So for example, if you have this picture, cute picture of your kid, we can make it better. We can drop the background color, pop the color, and make the kid even cuter. Or if you happen to have a very special memory, something in black and white, maybe of your mother and grandmother, we can recreate that moment in color and, and make that moment even more real. <laughs> 